When the shuttle enters the Mars atmosphere, the friction slows the spaceship from 13,200 miles per hour to 1,000 miles per hour. We do use different mechanisms to land safely. In today's challenge, you'll design and build a landing system for a raw egg. Commence Operation Egg Shuttle Drop. The foam balls act like airbags, spreading the kinetic energy to diffuse the force of the landing. And T.W. nails the landing. <laughs> it's actually T-dubs. Never mind, you're catching on. My triangular design of bamboo strips and horsetail rushes keeps the eggs snug as a bug in a rug. I was inspired by the Curiosity Rover Landing, my four propeller battery operated drone with Landing Straws Delivery Shuttle. My popcorn ball has no edges, and the rubber ball will absorb the landing impact. Plus, once it lands, you can eat it. My turn. your splat calculations with your design? Oh, my splat calcs? Well, you know me. I prefer to fly by the seat of my pants. Well, your pants should have factored in velocity, acceleration, density, and gravity. You know, Cam, you constantly surprise me with how smart you are. Ooh, campfire and Gordon sitting in a tree. Zach, seriously, do you and your annoying brother get tired of finding cam-related names to torture me? Because I do. No, nope. Camsterdam. Hamilton. Green eggs and cam? Sorry, I kind of got caught up. It's actually pretty clever. Oh, ditched. Is it just me or is something suspicious about Gordon? I mean, think about it. He didn't know the right percentage of bone density loss in space. He had no idea how to build a basic capacitor for the ham radio. And now with this egg shuttle, he's recreating up? Plus, he's always on his phone all secret-like. I took this photo of all of us on our first day. I'll send it to Brad. She can do an image search on the guy, see what we can dig up. I'll text Michaela to meet us after camp. We may have our new suspect. Um, Michaela, you know I'm always on your side, but I'm guessing the Quill would not be happy about this. I just have a hunch Carson Lazarus is somehow behind all this. Nobody wanted Innovate destroyed more than she did. And with the girls gone, I need your help. We are a team. Always have been. Where you go, I go. True BFFs. Are you crying? Uh, no. I just have a little pixel in my eye. Uh, <clears throat> hello? I'm here to spray for ants. Catnip Everdeen. Is there catnip behind their catnip? What are you trying to tell us? Something's not right. Oh, there are pH strips in your lab kit. Of course. We use pH strips to test it. If there's no color change, it'll confirm it's drywall. But if the color changes, it's something else. Need some water. Oh, good thinking. Stay hydrated. Not for me. I knew it. The acid levels show that the wall isn't made of drywall or wood. And some pieces are floating, suggesting it may be plastic, since many plastics are less dense than water. And since styrofoam is a type of plastic, 
It could be that. I must say it's a pleasure watching you work, girlfriend! Go, go us! Go, go us! That feels weird without the girls. I'm on it, Chica. Excuse me, senor. I'm told that Baño de Mujeres is this way. My shiny nose needs some dulling down. You aren't afraid of a few butterflies, are you? Mm. 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 Nobody leaves the building. Going already? But the party's just getting started. <laughs> One coat coming up. Are you? Your worst nightmare. We're sisters. Nice save. I learned from the best. People are starting to leave. You've got to keep them here. What are you doing? Looking over the feed from Maddie's smart contact. There's got to be something we missed. There it is! Something totally irresistible! Craig and Vex is here! Yay! Yay! Wait, why yay? Ears are the new fingerprints. Using a shape-finding algorithm, the outer ear is one of the most accurate ways to ID someone with 99.6% accuracy. Now that we have the image, we can identify Vex! Guys, I need ears. Copy that. I hear you, Bryden. Let's check some ears. <laughs> No matches yet. Keep them coming. Come on! The upside here is that when the quail witnesses the end of everything she's worked for, she'll also witness the end of you and your friends. It's not over yet. Oh, but it is. The servers are on lockdown. And if you're thinking of trying to escape, don't. I'm activating the death floor. <laughs> Whoops, wrong room, hang on. Now, stay put or fry. Guys, just think about basic training. We've gotten out of this before, we can do it again. New circumstances, and but... How'd you cut the rope? After all our escape room problems, I invented this special hair clip. It's called Cam's Multi-Purpose Hair Clip with assorted tools to deal with any dangerous situation. Including bad hair days. It's super cute. Muy bueno! We're free! It's serious electricity. That's why they took our shoes. Barefoot equals barbecued! Not if we use this. Why you're going to use me, but this is so exciting! Sorry, Addison, not you. My skateboard's rubber wheels won't conduct electricity. Cameron Coral, you are all kinds of prepared. That was awesome! Way to go! All right. 
Damn. That girl makes something so scary seem so fun! <gasps> It's okay, guys. Don't worry about me. We're not leaving without you. You won't have to. Wood is not affected by electricity, which means this bench should do. Wow! Cameron, you're not the only one with tricks up her sleeves. Six years in the Barcelona Junior Gymnastics team. Let's find that server room. <laughs>